Baylor's or Betelgeuse. It's a red giant star. If you put it where the sun is, it would extend out to the orbit of Jupiter. It's enormous, very unstable, and about to explode. Red giants are among the biggest explosions of radio energy in the entire universe, generating more energy than a billion suns. In the constellation Orion, there is a star that has captivated astronomers for centuries. Betelgeuse. This red supergiant star is much larger and more massive than our sun. But in recent years, Betelgeuse has been acting strangely. It has dimmed significantly and even begun to vibrate violently. This has led to speculations that this once vibrant star is on the verge of exploding in a supernova. But what if we're actually witnessing the onset of an even more terrifying event? What if Betelgeuse is not about to explode but rather about to collapse in on itself? Join us as we explore the latest research on Betelgeuse and its potential implications for our planet. Through this journey, we aim to understand the profound impact Betelgeuse's collapse could have on the future of the universe. Betelgeuse is an enormous star, 950 times larger than our sun, and is among the universe's largest. However, its size comes with a cost. Stars like this have limited lifespans, and Betelgeuse is no exception. It's a ticking time bomb poised to explode, but the exact moment remains a mystery. Situated just 650 light years away, Betelgeuse has captivated astronomers, shining as one of our closest stars. We marvel at its brilliance, trying to unravel the secrets hidden within its fiery depths. Though only 13% of its radiant energy is visible to us, if we could see its full brilliance, it would outshine even Sirius, ranking as the brightest in our night sky. Imagine a colossal star with a radius 764 times that of our Sun, stretching beyond the asteroid belt and almost touching Jupiter. Within this vast realm, Earth, Mars, Mercury, and Venus would be devoured by Betelgeuse's irresistible cosmic allure. But the mysteries don't end there. Every millennium, Betelgeuse sheds a solar mass, casting off its celestial remnant in a magnificent display of stellar theatrics. A nebula 250 times larger than the star itself envelopes Betelgeuse, shrouding it in an ethereal haze that captivates our gaze. This nebula, stretching 30 astronomical units, lures us into a cosmic dance of wonder, beckoning us to uncover its secrets. Let's journey deeper into the heart of Betelgeuse's creation, where the alchemy of hydrogen fusion ignites, birthing helium in a cosmic explosion. Over time, the star's hydrogen fuel dwindles, and a celestial metamorphosis ensues. Helium intertwines with carbon, unleashing a radiance that cascades through the cosmos. But even this grand fusion has its limits. As neon merges with iron, an astonishing transformation occurs. The star's gravity, unleashed by the absence of energy release, triggers an imminent collapse, propelling Betelgeuse toward a fate both inspiring and cataclysmic a supernova explosion. In the realm of cosmic phenomena, supernovae reign supreme, and Betelgeuse is no exception. With the energy of 10 billion suns, this colossal celestial entity unleashes a force that resonates throughout the cosmos, leaving us in awe of its unimaginable might. Throughout the ages, stars undergo a mesmerizing transformation, transitioning from the vibrant blues of youth to the fiery reds of maturity. It was during the 2nd century BC that Chinese stargazers made an intriguing observation, noting Betelgeuse's distinct yellow hue that set it apart from the celestial tapestry. As the centuries unfolded, the baton of observation passed to the keen eyes of Greco-Roman astronomer Tiamui in the middle of the 2nd century AD. In his meticulous records, he described Betelgeuse as having an orangish or ruddy appearance, a characteristic that still captivates our attention to this day. This consistent coloration across different civilizations, including medieval observers in the Middle East, adds to the intrigue surrounding Betelgeuse. The tale of Betelgeuse takes another twist as we dive deeper into its enigmatic behavior. The star surprised scientists in 2019 when it suddenly dimmed in brightness. Scientists thought that a large cloud of dust released from the star's surface blocked our view of it. However, the origin of the cloud is still unclear. Some scientists think that a large object, like a planet, might have disturbed the surface of the star or even been swallowed by it. In recent months, 
Betelgeuse has become almost 50% brighter than its average brightness, an unexpected occurrence, as stars usually become dimmer as they age. Scientists are not sure what caused this sudden increase in brightness, but they know that star brightness can change for a variety of reasons. For example, some stars go through cycles of bright and dim phases. The star Mira is known as the Star of Wonder because it changes in brightness, expanding and contracting regularly, which changes the amount of light it emits. This is a common occurrence with many stars, including Alol and about 30 other stars that can be seen in the night sky without a telescope. Deep within the heart of Betelgeuse, a seismic shift was occurring. The expulsion of scorching material launched into space created an ethereal dust cloud of magnificent proportions. This celestial dust cloak veiled a significant portion of Betelgeuse's radiant light, transforming it from a dazzling beacon to a subdued luminary in the night sky. Betelgeuse's brightness dipped to levels unimaginable. Once counted among the ten brightest stars, it now dimmed, ranking lower than the twentieth brightest. In recent months, Betelgeuse defied all expectations, challenging the norms of stellar behavior. Scientists and stargazers around the globe have been captivated by this mesmerizing cosmic dance. Theories abound, attempting to unravel the enigma of Betelgeuse's extraordinary behavior. Some speculate that massive sunspots or dust clouds are the culprits behind its dramatic fluctuations, while others ponder the possibility of coinciding cycles. Their research exposes the incredible notion that Betelgeuse's supernova explosion has already occurred. Yes, you heard that right. While conservative estimates projected its supernova event to be hundreds of thousands of years away, the evidence now suggests a different story. The last observed supernova in our galaxy, Kepler's supernova, graced the heavens centuries ago. Researchers have proposed a model suggesting that Betelgeuse is in the late stage of carbon burning, indicating it may be on the brink of a magnificent explosion. This positions it as a strong contender for the next anticipated supernova event in our Milky Way galaxy. Like a grand finale in the Cosmic Symphony, Betelgeuse stands as a prominent contender for the next stellar supernova within our beloved Milky Way galaxy. However, understanding Betelgeuse is like solving a puzzle with conflicting observations. There are indications of material ejections and subsequent recovery leaning towards a mass ejection event, although smaller in scale compared to our Sun. But here's the twist. Supernovae are real phenomena too. We witnessed one in a satellite galaxy of the Milky Way in 1987. So while our estimates for Betelgeuse's explosion timing may be uncertain, it's not time to plan a vacation around it just yet. The challenge lies in the current difficulty of observing Betelgeuse. Scientists have been studying Betelgeuse for centuries and have found that it has changed in brightness over time. This suggests that the star is aging and could go supernova soon. However, there is not enough evidence to say for sure when this will happen. A supernova is a very bright explosion that happens when a star dies. It is not harmful to life on Earth and is safe to watch from Earth with the naked eye. The brightness of a supernova depends on the size of the star that explodes. Betelgeuse is a very large star, so its supernova would be very bright. It would be about as bright as a half moon and visible during the daytime. The brightness of a supernova would also be a challenge for astronomers. The supernova would be so bright that it would make it difficult to see other stars and planets, making it challenging for astronomers to study the night sky. One possibility is that Betelgeuse swallowed a large object, such as another star, in the past. This could have sped up the star's evolution and made it more likely to go supernova. A recent paper has found something new about Betelgeuse's brightness cycles. The paper found that the longest period, which is 2,200 days long, could be the main cycle for Betelgeuse's pulsations. If this is the case, then the star's brightness could change significantly in the future. This is still just a hypothesis, and more research is needed to confirm it. However, it is an exciting development that could help us better understand Betelgeuse and its future. Overall, the brightness of a supernova would be a mixed blessing. It would be a beautiful and exciting event to witness, but would also be a challenge for astronomers and animals. What makes Betelgeuse an astronomical gem is not just its potential to go supernova, but the unique opportunity it presents. This colossal star, with its remarkable size and proximity, grants us the privilege of capturing its essence in breathtaking detail. 
Unlike distant twinkling points of light, Betelgeuse reveals itself as a radiant disk through the lens of our telescopes. It invites us to witness its luminous variations and grasp the subtle dance of its light as it teases us with its hidden secrets. But here's where things get even more fascinating. The supernova display won't vanish quickly. No, it will linger in our night sky for several years, gradually fading away like a distant star. Yet, there may be moments of resurgence, a burst of renewed brilliance before its light finally dims. The supernova, an ultimate cosmic fireworks display, would give us a rare and awe-inspiring opportunity to witness a once-in-a-lifetime spectacle. Despite the profound impact a supernova may have, it is essential to note that the effects on Earth would be minimal. The event would not pose any significant threat to life on our planet. However, it would undoubtedly mark an extraordinary chapter in the annals of cosmic history. With the possibility of witnessing such an event in our lifetime, Betelgeuse offers a tantalizing glimpse into the grandeur of the universe and the celestial wonders that await us. As we delve deeper into the enigma of Betelgeuse, it's essential to understand the broader implications of its potential supernova. Betelgeuse's eventual explosion, while a magnificent astronomical event, also serves as a window into the life cycle of massive stars and the cosmic processes that shape our universe. The life cycle of a star like Betelgeuse begins in the dense clouds of interstellar gas and dust, known as molecular clouds. Within these clouds, regions of higher density collapse under their own gravity, initiating nuclear fusion in their cores. This process marks the birth of a new star. Over millions of years, the star gradually accumulates mass, ignites hydrogen in its core, and enters the main sequence phase of its life. During this period, it fuses hydrogen into helium, releasing vast amounts of energy that counteracts gravitational collapse and creates the star's equilibrium. For most of its life, Betelgeuse, like other stars, spends its time in the main sequence phase. However, once the hydrogen in its core is exhausted, the star's core contracts while its outer layers expand and cool. This transformation turns it into a red giant. As Betelgeuse has already transitioned through this phase, it is now in the later stages of its life cycle, characterized by the burning of heavier elements. The red giant phase is a crucial period in a star's evolution, leading up to the eventual supernova. Betelgeuse's dramatic size and brightness are indicative of the intense nuclear fusion occurring in its core. This stage is marked by the fusion of helium into carbon and oxygen, which eventually leads to the creation of even heavier elements like neon and magnesium. The core's increasing mass leads to more complex and unstable conditions, creating a pressure cooker of nuclear reactions. One of the most intriguing aspects of Betelgeuse is its variability. Unlike more stable stars, Betelgeuse's luminosity fluctuates, making it a variable star. These fluctuations are tied to the star's pulsations and the complex dynamics within its outer layers. The periodic dimming and brightening of Betelgeuse are linked to changes in its outer envelope, which can expand and contract due to variations in pressure and temperature. This pulsation process can lead to significant alterations in brightness and even influence the surrounding space environment. The surrounding nebula, known as the Betelgeuse Nebula, plays a significant role in the star's final stages. This expansive shell of gas and dust has been ejected over time and contributes to the star's overall luminosity and spectral characteristics. The nebula also interacts with the stellar wind, which further shapes the surrounding space and influences the star's eventual supernova. When Betelgeuse finally reaches the end of its life, it will undergo a supernova explosion. This explosion results from the core's collapse under gravity, leading to a massive release of energy. The explosion expels the star's outer layers into space, enriching the interstellar medium with heavy elements. These elements, created through nuclear fusion in the star's core, are crucial for the formation of new stars, planets, and even life. Thus, Betelgeuse's supernova will contribute to the cosmic cycle of matter, ensuring the continued evolution of the universe. The supernova will also generate a neutron star or black hole, depending on the remaining mass of the core. A neutron star is an incredibly dense object with a mass about 1.4 times that of the sun but compressed into a sphere with a radius of only about 10 kilometers. If the core's mass exceeds this limit, 
it will collapse further, forming a black hole, an object with gravity so intense that not even light can escape its grasp. The supernova of Betelgeuse will be visible from Earth, offering a spectacular view for astronomers and stargazers alike. The event will be bright enough to rival the light of the full moon and will be observable even in daylight. This brightness will provide an invaluable opportunity to study the detailed processes of a supernova, including the explosion's dynamics, the distribution of heavy elements, and the formation of the neutron star or black hole. Beyond the immediate observational excitement, Betelgeuse's explosion will have long-term scientific significance. By studying the remnants of the supernova, scientists can gain insights into the formation of neutron stars and black holes. The event will also offer clues about the life cycles of massive stars and the processes that govern stellar explosions. In addition to its scientific value, Betelgeuse's supernova will also capture the imagination of the public. The visual spectacle of such an event, combined with its implications for our understanding of the universe, will inspire future generations of astronomers, physicists, and space enthusiasts. The story of Betelgeuse exemplifies the beauty and complexity of the cosmos and serves as a reminder of the dynamic and ever-changing nature of our universe. As we anticipate the potential supernova of Betelgeuse, it is essential to continue monitoring this remarkable star. Ongoing observations and research will help refine our predictions and enhance our understanding of its final moments. The journey of Betelgeuse from a magnificent red giant to a supernova is a testament to the incredible processes that shape the universe and an exciting chapter in the ongoing exploration of the cosmos.